Joseph here. This book is 35 International Wilderness Survival Tricks. This book is clocking in at 119 pages and a word count of over 35,000. This book here, it's a sample of my work so people can get a good uh, taste of what I offer. Uh, then they can go to my survival programs and my other work and they know what they're going to get. What I'm going to do for this one, you have the table of contents there on that website. What I'm going to do here is I uh, go over a few of them so you can see what, what you're going to get. Uh, let me go over the first one, Leyden's Burn Remedy. One day I was pouring hot coffee into a thermos, I'm, I'm sorry, boiling hot water in, into the thermos right off my stove. It was boiling hot. I was making tea. The funnel slipped and I poured hot water on my hand and wrist. And you know how the, the brain takes about a second or so before it, it realizes that you're, that you're getting burned. You can feel the pain. Well, the damage was already done. The damage on my wrist and hand was so bad that it burned the skin clean off my uh, that particular part of the uh, hand and wrist. And it was the whole entire area stop sign red. It was red, red. And then the pounding pain started. Bottom line, what I did, I put a concoction on there that worked so good, so fast, and healed it. There's, to this day, there's no scar or anything. Especially, like I say, stop the pain so fast, like within a minute or so, that everybody has to know about this. And this concoction, it's cheap, should be in every uh, first aid kit, every ambulance, every emergency room, you know, because it, it works so good. And plus, it saves a lot of money. I could have went to the hospital and spent a few hundred bucks uh, just to get bandaged up, but I didn't. I just treated myself. Now, I'm not telling you not to do that. To do that, I'm telling you, hey, you got to do what you got to do. If you got, if, if you burn yourself, go to the doctor. But this is an alternative. If you're out there camping, hunting, hiking, whatever, if you get burned, you know, messing with your fire or something, this is this will do the trick. I'm telling you. The next one is sauna in a can. I read a lot about these incidents happening throughout the United States and throughout the world of people dying of hypothermia. Well. I learned this on in the can was I, when I was a private know-nothing in the Army. And I used it after that, and it probably saved my life. And this will work when you're soaking wet. It's 10 below zero. It'll still work. I'm telling you. That's sauna in a can. Another one I want to talk about as far as hunting. Hunting's hard enough. And I teach tricks how to compel uh, uh, the critters to come to you. But these two tricks I'm going to talk about is uh, the first one is no weapon duck hunting. You don't need any weapon whatsoever. Even you duck hunters out there, if you've been hunting ducks for decades, this one you have you've never heard of. Okay, sneaking up on ducks and they're right there. They'll they they don't even know you're coming. Goose final approach. Another one. The the geese come to you. You just set it up and forget it. Uh, techniques that I've interviewed uh, uh, real hunters that uh, uh, they told me the story and it was incredible. So for you duck hunters and geese hunters, these two stories you've never heard of. You got to know about them. And for you amateurs that never hunted in your life and you find yourself in a survival situation, this is it. you got to know about these. Another one I talk about uh, when I was talking about hypothermia, I want to tell you about emergency fire starting. Rub your shoe in a rock. I invented this like other advanced and ultra-advanced fire starting, emergency fire starting applications in my survival programs. This one it works because you're using the weight of your body. You're using the weight of your body. If you've truly been hypothermic, and I've been there, I'm telling you, if you can't if you, your fit, when you're truly hypothermic, your fingers will not work. You can't pull, you can't button your shirt, you can't button your coat, you can't pull up the zipper on your pants or anything. Your fingers will not work. So how are you going to get matches and lighters to work? They ain't. Okay, I'm telling you. And uh, so I designed this so you're using the weight of your body to get an emergency fire going. Okay, another one is a pounding toothache remedy. I'm telling you, I had a pounding toothache remedy that was so bad. If they could, if them, them CIA, CIA guys or whoever they are, they want to inter interrogate them Hodges. They don't need any waterboarding. And do some bad toothache and they'll start talking. I'll tell you how I remedied this toothache like uh, right now. And, and uh, I use this concoction and it costs pennies, really. And the last one, this is a gimme. Uh, this, is, uh, this one I put in there for, for you. Reprogram yourself from failure to success. I give you a website to go to. This is a Mind Over Matter application. Like I always tell my folks, my subscribers or potential subscribers, if you don't believe mind, mind over matter type things, it ain't going to happen. Okay? But if you believe it, hey, something, something might happen. Uh, anyway, I give you this website to go to, and they teach us mind, very simple mind over matter application. And, and bef before you know it, and I've, I've used this, before you know it, you'll find yourself doing stuff you wouldn't have normally done. Somehow this thing gets you to do things to, to guide you, to, to push you in the right direction for your success. Okay? And I always believe that people, most people are reprogrammed in their head 
in a negative manner because the way you were brought up or something, the way you think about money and things of this nature. So you got to reprogram yourself in a in a in a in a in a way to so you can get that success that you want, whatever it is. Okay, that's it for this book, Thirty Five International Wilderness Survival Tricks. Go ahead and go on to the next video. Oh, let me stop before I forget. If you want these 35 International Wilderness Survival Tricks for free, I ain't going to charge you a dime, you can go to my website, one of my websites. It's called www.anytimeanywheresurvival.com. Sign up. Just put your name and your email address, and every three days you'll get uh, one of these survival tricks. You'll get all 35 of them. Okay? Uh, that's www.anytimeanywhere.com. Survival.com. Okay, go ahead and go on to the next video.